Hundreds of Hawkeye fans are gathering in Coralville for this year's Fry Fest. They're celebrating everything black and gold tonight at the Coralville Marriott. The celebration has been taking place mostly inside today because of the heat. Fox 28 News reporter Jason Hackett joins us now to give us a peek at tonight's party. Jason. Scott, the party is outdoors now after being inside most of the day. Uh, country music superstar Chris Cagle is on stage performing right now, and it's still kind of warm outside, but we learned today that it'll take a lot more to stifle Hawkeye pride. Let's go, Hawks! Let's go, Hawks! The anticipation is growing. You know, you see all the countdowns throughout town and on Facebook and whatnot. The excitement is building. Go, Hawks! Go, Hawks! Go, Hawks! As for the temperatures, well, they're rising. So uh, it's probably the hottest summer I can remember in Iowa for a while. Another season is set to kick off, with Fry Fest today being the opening act. But have high temperatures left the black and gold faithful feeling blue this weekend? Not a chance. I think the anticipation will cancel out the heat. Concert goers tonight say bring on the heat. I'm hot, but when you're a Hawkeye fan, you come to Hawkeye City to do Hawkeye things. Doesn't matter what the weather is. In fact, all eyes tomorrow will be on a different forecast, the success of this year's season. For that, we'll go to our own Fox 28 junior prognosticators. Guys? We have to play some good teams, so I don't think we're going to do good. Ouch. What do you say, Elizabeth? How many games are there? Well, maybe like eight out of 12. But it's Emerson who likely reflects the wish of most Hawkeye fans. I hope they're undefeated, but I don't think it will happen. I just hope. Hope is what Saturdays, even hot ones, are made of. That concert from Cagle started just about 30 minutes ago. Then after that, I imagine that it's bedtime because tomorrow it's game time. Covering the corridor in Coralville, Jason Hackett, Fox 28 News.